Welcome, friends. Pem dien jata jums un at bildi arjoshino. So that's Monday Q and A in Latvian. Although unfortunately, the pronunciation guide on Google Translate is awful for Latvian. Just awful. It's basically a broken, high-pitched version of Microsoft Sam. So I'm guessing that I said it about 80% wrong, and that's being uh, conservative with my estimate. Anyway, updates for this week. So I've been in Budapest, Hungary's capital, for this weekend, and I've not been able to make any videos. So sorry about that. But I have had a wonderful time, and Budapest is a beautiful city and very interesting with some very striking architecture. Also, because of the exchange rate and the cost of living, we were able to rent out a flat for less than a hotel and ended up being in the centre itself, overlooking the square. And it was breathtaking. Thank you very much to Hungary for having me. I'm also running a competition which I would like to clear some confusion about. The competition is to submit a script for a little scene to make in the game. You don't have to make the video yourself, and it isn't for a challenge. Just write a little script like you would do for a TV show, with your character, their speech, and the setting. I'll choose the best and act them out in the game, and people will vote on the best video, basically, with likes. I asked for a short 20 to 30 second script because I don't want to ask people for too much. You shouldn't be doing my work for me. So on to the question, Roonies. Vibes says you like One Piece because of Nami's massive melons too, don't you? Don't you watch Sword Art Online too? Actually, I really am not a fan of Oda's decision to make the female characters even more unrealistic with their giant breasts. They quite frankly look ridiculous. And yep, I do watch Sword Art Online, and I'm not too sure if I like the second series as much. Also, in general, I probably enjoyed Log Horizon more, which was, has much more of a political and tactical overtone. Nick Pereira asks, what is the meaning of life? Well, it's a really funny Monty Python film, and I really recommend it to everyone. Amazing bunch of shorts from the comedy geniuses themselves. Andy Dye asks, do you prefer the city life or the country life? Um, honestly, I quite prefer the city life. There is so much more to do, and so much better internet. Also, you can go to a shop or order a pizza whenever. I do love the countryside and I love nature, but I would rather do that to relax from the humdrum of the city rather than to be in the countryside all of the time. HD asked, What would you think if SOE made Planetside 3? I wouldn't be surprised, but I think it would be a long way off and hopefully it would be cutting edge for its time, so I'd definitely be the first to, on the ship to play first, and hopefully join in the beta. Or alpha testing, perhaps. Exact in Midget 92 says, 8 megabits is fast for you. How bad is the internet in your place? I have 100 megabits here in California. Well, actually, a lot of people mention the internet, and yeah, it still isn't amazing, but they have similar speeds inside English cities or towns and larger villages. But when you live in the centre of masses of farmland, the internet isn't so great. But perhaps the wildlife is a little better. Steve Walter says, Akami Gakiru is a great manga, but is an anime as good? Does anyone know? Well, actually, obviously I can't answer this one as I'm just an anime watcher. But I definitely think it is the best show this season. Mukprolf says, I'm unhappy with my life. What's up, matey? Have some e-feels. Be sure to talk to somebody if it is actually serious, though. Max Mueller says, Hey Joshino, how to join Vib? Well, it isn't really an open outfit, sorry. They are all quite close friends that have been playing the game for years and have been through the same drama I have. We are also mostly best rank 100s and play the game in a way that has no structure and we all expect each other to know what to do rather than be bossed about. However, if you are serious and you have a high level character, you can come on the Woodman team speak and get to know everybody, but then that's really the only way of getting in. Everyone Asleep123 asks, If you could live in any other country, where would you live? And what surf would you play in Planetside 2? I feel that if I ever visited Scandinavian countries, I may be able to fall in love with them. But as I haven't, I would say that I'd love to live in Germany, and specifically in Berlin. I feel that for all the UK's shortcomings, it is a very safe, advanced and quite open country. However, when I went to Berlin, it was like England, except everyone was friendlier. People also seem to have more of a sense of community and duty to their fellow person. So really, I'd love to live there. Voss Magpie says, Hey little Josh, I really love your English accent. My question is, what do you think about ISIS? Okay, that's a bit more of a serious one. 
Well, I feel the whole situation in Iraq and Syria is very complex. So firstly, I do think that the mass murders and executions and the very core extreme ideology, ISIS or Daesh, as some people are calling it, I think, is not acceptable in the modern and global world. Also, the very concept of a jihad is wrong. You should not subjugate people to agree with your ideology, and killing those that don't agree with you is disgusting. People should have the right to be able to choose their own beliefs and ideals. However, in the region there is a long history of violence between all the different groups. Sunnis against Shia, Shia against Sunni, Kurdish and Sunnis... Not always one way either. Furthermore, the West's own intervention which caused large losses of life. There are all sorts of tensions and historic grudges inside a very small part of the Middle East. Add that to the fact that the Middle East was still recovering with little prospects economically for its residents and you don't have much to lead a normal life for. I feel that people are quite easily to influence in that situation and it is sad they have become like that. Either way, I don't feel clued in enough to give any answer, but you can only hope for some form of peace soon, so people can try and live properly. That's it for the questions this week. Thank you very much everyone for watching. If you want to ask me a question for next week, put it in the comments below. Also, if you enjoyed the video, give us a like, and if you'd like to hear more from me, subscribe. Until next time everyone, Joshino.